Biometrics 101. As Papillon, we are one of the leading companies on biometrics. So, what is biometrics? We use biometric data at many points in our daily lives. Even the recognition of each other's faces during mutual greeting constitutes biometric data. The term biometrics comes from ancient Greece. It means the measurement of the living. In other words, biometrics is the measurement of biological elements that make us different. Meanwhile in China. In scientific researches, it was published that there were images of the use of handprints as evidence while the theft investigations. Biometrics allows us to separate people. There are many types of biometrics. Examples of physical biometrics are fingerprints, face, and iris. Keyboard striking patterns, gait, and signature can be shown as examples of behavioral biometrics. Biometrics are universal. Everyone in the world has fingerprints, faces, and irises. At the same time, it is unique to the person. Fingerprints, faces, and irises of each person have different characteristics. The use of biometrics has two important purposes. The first of these is authentication and the second is identification. Let's say you want to enter your bank account with facial verification. The system will match your face data with your instant scan information, which you previously defined, and will only open your bank account if your face information is correct. It's called authentication. Identification means the verification of unknown biometric data. Let's say a detective found an unknown fingerprint at the scene. This unknown fingerprint is interrogated with other fingerprints in the system and it is determined whose unknown fingerprint belongs to. This is also called identification. Biometrics can be used in many different areas and in different ways that make our daily lives easier. What's next? Follow Papillon and find out.